I would like to uh, first of all congratulate James Langford on his victory this evening. Uh, he won because he had an awesomely loyal network of people through his church and because he worked very hard and very skillfully to inspire his network to get involved and to vote and volunteer. And that is very commendable. Networking is the very basis of politics. He deserves it. Uh, he has my support. I wish him well. And I will continue to pray for him and his family. We worked hard too, and we would have deserved it if we had won. Thank you. So I have poured out everything into this race because that was my calling. I'm confident that I've done what the Lord wanted me to do. This is not a time for bitterness or regret or what if. This is a time for celebration of what it means to serve one's country within a calling from God. The Lord has something different in mind for Tony and us now. I don't know what that is, but it has always been my honor to serve, whether it was in the state legislature, in the military, at my church, or just as a good husband, father, and neighbor. It is in these latter roles that I look forward to now. I also look forward to a continued bond between us, those of us here today, a bond of patriotic conservatism, of love of country in the coming years. And so on behalf of Tony and myself, once again, may God bless you and God bless America. Thank you.